Hey YouTube, this is Andrea here. And Andrea. Woo -woo. <laughs> we are here with another plan with me. This is for our happy planner and we're going to be using these stickers. They are called Sweet Treats. And you can see they have cupcakes and look at the little cute cupcakes on the checklist. I love that. They have hearts. I love those. Oh, look how cute the washi tape is. So adorable. Check out more cupcakes. Oh, I love it. These are so cute. Then we have to do today, little things, work, personal. We all know about those. And then we have our half boxes. Just turn that around. So let's get started. I'm going to be using our cover-up tape, as I always do, to cover up these numbers because they don't quite go with our kit. And they're just like all big. <laughs> so the last time we were here, Drea was going to go on a date. Oh God. <laughs> That was no. Sunday. That was that was in my video that we mentioned it, not yeah. your video. Well, you'll have to check out Dre's video to learn about how the date trans got to become a date. But this video, we could just skip all that and go, hey, what happened? How'd it go? It went good. <laughs> <laughs> I hate when she puts me on the spot. <laughs> So good, huh? He yeah. turned out to be a really nice guy in person, he as was well as... funny. He was funny and he was interesting. And he had the best personality that out of anybody I've ever met. Wow. Which is saying a lot because I've met quite a few people. This is true. And all their personalities were like dry rot. Oh. That's, <laughs> dry rot is not a good personality trait to have. No. <laughs> That's like gross. Or they were jerks. Yeah. But he was nice. He was a gentleman. He was funny. He was interesting. It was fun. I had a good time. Awesome. Awesome. It sounds like a good time. Yeah. So what'd you guys, where'd you go? I forgot to ask you. A coffee shop. Awesome. The coffee, was it good? Um... I didn't put any creamer or sugar in it, so it, <laughs> it could have been better <laughs> because it was straight up black coffee and I can't stand straight up black coffee, but I was too nervous to put anything in it, so <laughs> <laughs> I just left it like that and sucked it down as fast as possible. Uh, I'm not really a black coffee person either. Um, yeah, we like our creamer and our sugar. Yeah. So I could totally relate to your not liking that coffee very much. But normally that coffee shop has good coffee, huh? Yeah. If you're smart enough to get up and put creamer and sugar in. You were nervous. It's okay. You could drink your black coffee and be nervous. It's all right. <laughs> Hopefully if we go there again... I'll be smart enough to get up and get some creamer and sugar because I could not, oh, my face just kept contorting. <laughs> it was so bad. Oh. That's not fun. No. Especially when you're trying to pay attention to what he's saying mm. and you're sitting there making faces. <laughs> yeah. Then he's probably like, damn, she must not like me. What's on my face? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, and all along it was your coffee. <laughs> yeah, the whole time it was my coffee. He was perfectly fine. And I'm like, oh, this coffee is so bad. Oh, how funny. The only good part about it was that it was iced coffee. So the ice kind of helped water down the blackness of it. Yeah. The, 
the strength of it. That's what I was looking for. Oh, yeah, because it was really strong. Oh, huh? it was super strong. I was like, oh, my God, I'm going to be up forever. I'm going to be up <laughs> for years. That's weird. But you were telling me, I think you were telling me, that this coffee shop fills your cup up to overflowing Almost before over you even get to the sugar in that. Almost overflowing. They fill it up to the point where if you try to walk to the little area that has the cream on sugar, you will spill it up. <laughs> That's how much they fill it up. Well, uh, just to let the people know, the coffee shop that you went to is right across the street from the university. So they cater to the college students, college students who need black coffee. Yeah, to stay up, stay awake because they partied all night and whatnot. Or they're doing a study cram session. There were actually a lot of students there where that was studying. Yeah, well that's good. Yeah. So they're taking summer school then. Yeah. But it was fun. I had a nice time and he asked me out on a second date. Aww. Don't know when. <laughs> <laughs> Don't but, know where, but <laughs> but he asked me out on one, so yay. Yay. That just means you guys got along really well. Yeah. <clears throat> cool. And we talk every day online. <laughs> which is fun. That's cool. I remember back in my day. Oh, goodness. <laughs> we didn't have, like, internet conversations and, um... No, you had to speak over the phone. Yeah, we had a phone, a hard line is what they called it. Landline. Yeah. And, uh... We got to talk for a few minutes because that was expensive. Yeah. You know. I remember. And long distance was an actual long distance company. Um, like AT and T was a long distance company back then, mm -hmm. and now they're a cell phone company, mm -hmm. which I find interesting. At least they <coughs> got to bless you. Thank you. At least they got to um, fix their company so that they didn't belly up once cell phones took over. Yeah. I remember when cell phones first came out. Yeah, so do I. And I was like, hey, we got a bag phone! <laughs> <laughs> it was so cool. Back when big phones were cool. Well... Now the thinner the phone, the cooler it is. Yeah, that's true. Though they're getting larger. Oh yeah, they got the, they're the size of tablets now. Which is retarded. I saw this one video on YouTube where this guy was um, uh, standing on a... It looked like a flat screen TV. It was his phone. And uh, he, he, then he laid down when it rang. <laughs> And he answered it, and he was just laying there like, yeah, man. Da, 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 da. <laughs> like was he was song. all cool. <laughs> that's hilarious. Yeah. He said, that's how big t uh, phones are going to be. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right. So we got those covered up. Star Trek comes out this week? Yeah, so we have Ice Age Collision Course and Star Trek Beyond Beyond on the 22nd. They both come out at the same time. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's kind of tough. We gotta get all those mm, Not really. Kids. Well, they can just see two movies. Because yeah. little kids and big kids are going to want to see both. Yeah. I thought you meant for us. I was like, that's, with Grandma, that decision has already been made. What? If, if we were to go see a movie, which movie it would be? Oh, that decision's start, already yeah, made. Yeah, we're not seeing Ice Age. No, I know. 
Although I'll probably get it when it comes out on DVD. Because I like them. Yeah, I know. They've come out with a lot of Ice Age. Yeah, and they have. And each one gets better. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. Usually sequels suck. Yeah, for cartoons. Huh? From No, for any movie. Any movie that has a sequel, it sucks. Yeah? Yeah. Mm. Try that again. <laughs> what happened? I didn't get it straight. It was all hanging out over there. Huh. There we go. Much better. <clears throat> I like Star Trek. I like all the uh, new Star Treks. I didn't think I would because I'm an old Star Trek person. Mm -hmm. And, um,. Like Captain Picard and Captain Kirk old. Yeah. I'm just, I'm, I'm Granny Star Trek old. Picard's not that old. Picard was my era. Yeah. You like Picard? Well, yeah, he was my era. <laughs> and I like Deep Space Nine, which I was my era. That was my favorite. I wish they would make movies based on Deep Space Nine. I love that one. It was one of my favorite ones. What was her name? Uh, she, pretty Lady. There was a lot of pretty ladies. No, not in Deep Space Nine. There were. Yeah, there were. Who? There was the Trill, the one with the dots all over her body. Oh yeah, I remember Very her. Dwarf. Yeah. And then there was uh, Kira. That's the, who I think I'm talking about. Yeah, the one married to the Indian doctor. Yeah. I say Indian doctor only because that's I know him as an Indian actor. Oh yes, I remember him now. And they're yeah. married in real life, or they were. I'm not sure if they still are. I think mm -hmm. they are. Could be. If they if they are, that's awesome because that's decade. Yeah. Well, that's Plus. like um, uh, what's her name and Kurt Russell. Goldie Hawn. Yeah. Who been, aren't married. No, but they've been together since the eighties. Yeah. Have and then you know, Kate Hudson. Kate Hudson is their daughter. Well, her daughter. She's not Kurt Russell's daughter. No. No. She's Brock Hudson's daughter. Really? Yeah. I thought Rock Hudson was uh, gay. Brock <laughs> Hudson. Brock? I believe so. I love Goldie Hawn. She was one of the best actresses when I was growing up. Um, she's, oh my god, she used to crack me up. I just ate a bug. <laughs> um, on uh, Overboard, that was one of my favorite movies. Yeah, where she was rich. Yeah. And he was the, like, mechanic or something. Yeah. No, he was the... The he, motor. Yeah, he was the... Cap Captain. Yeah. Cap well, isn't it Captain something? No, that's a different movie. That's Captain Ron. Oh. Anyway, I like them. Wasn't she in Bird on a Wire with Mel Yes. Nelson? That was a hilarious one. And it's it's in the 80s. So the, um, the, um, it's so cheesy. The, like, the, what do they call that? Background... Um, graphics and all that is so FX, cheesy. Special effects? Yeah, special effects. Oh my god, so cheesy. But funny. They made it so funny. And, uh, and then I loved her in First Wives Club. Oh, I did too. That was a good one. Her and Bette Midler and Diane Keaton. Yeah. Nice. That was a nice one. That was a good movie. It was sad in some spots, but they got 
they, you know, grew, grew stronger from what happened. Oh, yeah. With their divorces and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because they punished those guys. <laughs> oh, yeah. They got even. They got even Steven. So funny. And even the daughter of uh, Diane Keaton, she's like, oh, daddy, I'm gay. <laughs> yep. And his face is just like, what? <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. And by the way, dad. Yep. Mom's suing you, and I'm gay. <laughs> yeah. Have a nice day. Have a good life. Yep. See, those were pretty together. Yeah. Good good selection. Never said what week we're doing. Oh my goodness, I'm so sorry guys. This is the week of the 18th through the 24th. The 24th. Thank you, Dre. You're welcome. The 18th through the 24th. I like that. It's so pretty. Yeah. Got a lot going on, huh? Yeah. That's me. I always have a lot going on. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so many plans, so little time. So little time. Okay, we're going to get down to our functional stickers. get our numbers on here. I've got 18. There's a movie that Goldie Hawn made that I wasn't allowed to see because I was a little girl. Or maybe that was Jane Fonda. Barbarella? Barbarella, yep, exactly. I wasn't allowed to see that because uh, it was like spicy. All risque, yeah. Not like movies nowadays where you have like 50 shades of. Do me this way and that way. <laughs> oh, and they just finished recording the, or not recording, they've just finished doing the last film for the series. I told you that Fifty Shades of Grey was a series. No, how, yeah. many, how many films are they trying to do? Well, they just finished the last one. I don't know how many there are. I think there's only no. one. No. Was there another one after Fifty Shades of Grey? Yeah. There was like, it was like a trilogy. Oh, was it? Yeah. So they shot two more movies. Pretty sure, yeah. Wow. Because the last one that they just recorded or did, whatever you called it, is um, <laughs> Fifty Shades Freed. Really? Yeah. That's... I, I'm, I'm not going to lie, and the audience may not agree with me, but I thought that was the dumbest movie on the planet. 
because there is not a normal woman out there who would allow a man to do all the crap he did to her and then uh, treat her like crap when he got mad and then keep going back and then she kept going back exactly I'm sorry it's just it, that's not real life and I don't want teenagers who go to see this movie to think it's real life. There is nothing real life about that movie. That's called sick minded. There's nothing healthy about that movie. No, uh uh. I don't even know why they made it a movie. They shouldn't have. Because I don't want teenagers to think that that's okay. It's not. It's not okay to be treated that way. And I don't care how he treats her in the end of the movie. It's not okay for all the crap that he did. Yeah. And now we're going to have all these teenage boys thinking, Hey, I can do that with my girlfriend. Yeah. Or some random chick that likes me. Yeah, exactly. <clears throat> I'll go find some random chick that likes me uh, and make her do those things. No, it's that is not right. It's not right. So I, I wish they had never made it. Functional. We're gonna be using our. I'm going to use marquees. movie marquees, and I'm going to use green, kind of go with that one. You're just going to use what? Green. One? Yeah, yes, just <laughs> <laughs> I thought you said what? No. Nope. <laughs> You're just going to use what? <laughs> <laughs> Not even. <laughs> oh, buddy. I'm all like, what? Yeah. Yeah, what? <laughs> My gosh. <laughs> Fine. This one is Ice Age Coalescing Course. And then Star Trek Beyond. Those are done. No appointments. No packages, because they're all coming today, right? Well, my cellophane bags are supposed to come at some point. Oh, God. <sighs> we have got to stop ordering from China. When it comes to important stuff like that. Yeah. I love these little cupcakes you made. Thank you. You always make something different. I like that about your stickers. Yeah. I do too. I thought so. Um, hold on a sec. Need the sheet. This is one too. I know. It just came out too light. I know. Okay. I wasn't going to point it out. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> so you weren't going to use it? No. Okay. I can't see it. <laughs> Fine. Yeah, the other day I had some technical errors with my printer. The technical error being I was out of ink. Oh, no. <laughs> so I had to use my grandma's printer to print out all the stickers. And, and then she was she running ran out of ink. She was running out of ink. So some of the stickers on this sheet that mom's using came out too light, but the ones on other sheets are fine. Yeah, they got the they got the ink. Yeah. They're actually the correct color. 
Yeah. Now, I noticed I, I left this one kind of blank. Yep. What's that about? Oh, I'm gonna have to get rid of one little cupcake. Yeah. That's cute. Yep. I might keep that. Maybe I'll put the little cupcake up here. As soon as I unstick it from my finger. <laughs> there. How cute. So, we didn't have any craziness uh, happened to us while we were dumpster diving, <laughs> so that's good. No bugs jumped out at us. No mysterious liquids. <laughs> no, yeah, and nobody fell <laughs> down a two fit, two fit, two, two foot drop. Yeah, no falling this time. I'm gonna go back there and measure that drop. I think it's about three feet actually. Yeah, it was pretty deep. I know. I fell. I know. <laughs> I know you fell. That was sucky. That was scary. Yeah, it was. We did go by a um, place, it's called the Dollar General, and we were driving up and uh, we were going to look through their bin, and I look over and my daughter's all like, Dre was all like, uh, Mom, um, look at Burger King. <laughs> Biggest day, Burger King sitting there, and I'm like, oh, I guess we're not going to look here. Brightest day. Yeah. Yeah, just sitting right next to it. I wasn't even paying attention. I don't even know what time Burger King closes. Yeah, it was like a beacon. It was so bright. I know. You thought I was just going to keep going, but you know, when I slowed down, you were all like, uh, what are you doing? <laughs> Why are you stopping? It's too bright. I don't mind it bright. Save on uh, batteries for our little headlamps. <laughs> Oh, nice. How to use the little planner. Yep. And I gotta use the cupcakes. Yep. Mondays are always pretty free. Mondays so are always cupcake day. <laughs> I wish. Uh -huh. Um. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right here. Cute. Adorable. Fun 
it's in too much. I like it right there. Okay. Yeah, that one really does. That one blends in a little too much. Let's try a different spot. They're on the chair. Right here. Or right there. There. Now you can see it. Yes. Maybe this does blend in too much. It does. So. I'll put it right here. Cute. I like that. And the adorable planner. I love it. I love it. Then we'll do our YouTubes. And I'm going to go with this blue here. That's pretty, huh? Yeah, but you have a lot of blue. No, you have this blue left, which matches better. That's more of a teal. Yeah, I have four days. Oh, okay, well, use, use these first. You know what movie I find funny? I thought it was funny anyway. Um, remember Will Smith when he was playing like the dating person? Hitch. Hitch? Yeah, that's the movie. And I was all... The, my, the funniest part I found that was the funniest part where he kicks her off. Where the he kicks her in the head, <laughs> and she falls into the water. <laughs> I thought the funniest part to me was the funniest parts was when he gets allergic to the shellfish, <laughs> yeah. and his face just blows up. <laughs> yeah. And when she um, starts crying weirdly. <laughs> Because her, her father, I think it was her, her uncle. Uh, yeah, but he was like a serial killer or yeah. something. <laughs> and she's just got the most humorous cry <laughs> ever. Oh my god, that was so funny. It was a good movie. Yeah, it was. Oh my gosh. Another sheet. Yeah, I meant to tell you guys about these stickers. So these are Plan with Watch Plan with Me video stickers. And then these are all for bows and brains. These are YouTube stickers, play buttons, and then the movie marquee. And then that's part of the kit. And then there's um, little planner stickers that you can get. They're printable. These are printable, so you don't have to wait for them to come in the mail. You can print them yourself on sticker paper. Then we have our coffee stickers, which I'm going to use this pink one. I'm going to put it here. Cute. There you go. Coffees and cupcakes. Yeah. Then there's Happy Mail stickers. Or bad mail. Everybody gets mail every day, but hopefully you get happy mail every day. Or frequently enough. Yeah. Then we have our trash cans. And... They're super miniature. <laughs> yeah, it's super miniature. They're pretty tiny, but they fit. I mean, I didn't want to make them so big that your whole box is just one big trash can. Yeah. I wanted to make them tiny enough that way you, you could fit other stickers. Yeah. 
Then there's switch time to switch purses stickers. This comes actually in a sheet of three mm -hmm. rows. Um, so they're a little smaller. I got the cut in the one-offs. So <clears throat> then there's the weight sticker. And I've been weighing myself every week. And those are also printable. And I still weigh the same. <laughs> Haven't gained an ounce. Well, that's a good thing. Yeah, but I haven't lost any either. Yeah, but I'd rather maintain than gain. Right? That's true. And then we have our polish stickers. Which are not printable. No, you could get these in the mail. Yes. And I do that on Thursdays. And then we have currently reading stickers. Which are also mailable. That you can get uh, mailed to you. I'm going to put this one here. Yeah, definitely a sidebar sticker. Yeah. Cute. Yeah. Here we go. And then I'm going to use my dots, like I always do. I like these dots for making bullet points. They're not the straight bullet points that you can make like while you're working on a computer, but they're the crooked kind. Yeah, and I don't have to have straight, right? Right. I mean, it's your plan. That's right. I can do crooked dots if I want to. And you are. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yes, I am. This time I'm not putting them all on top of one another, though. Yeah. So that's they're, a good thing. They're crooked in a row. That's right. Yeah. A whole row of crooked. I'm going to use these little page flags. Cute. Do my little meal plan here. And then weigh myself. So I'll eat. But <laughs> your meal plan's supposed to go on the day you cook. <laughs> I know. Yeah. We got packages this week. All right. That's wonderful. I love how it turned out. What do you think? How did Cute. I do? I like it. Yeah? Yeah. Thank you. I hope everybody enjoyed the video. Um, and if you have any questions, please leave them down below. If you um, have any requests, please also leave that down below and we'll get back to you as soon as we can. Please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe for more great videos coming your way. Have a good one. Bye. Bye.